She's now 49 years old. She's gained more weight than she ever has, but she has this thought in the back of her mind that says, okay, I just gotta go on a diet. I've done this before, I'll do it again. So lifting Laura reduces her calories to 1400 calories per day. But this time, the weight's not really moving. So what does she do? She does what everybody would do. She reduces her calories further. She now reduces her calories to 1200 calories per day. She does this for a few weeks and unfortunately the same thing. Her body weight is not moving. The scale is not showing any loss in body weight and even her body composition reports aren't showing any loss of body fat. Now she reduces her calories to a thousand calories per day. And it's important to know, she's been maintaining her fitness routine. She hasn't changed anything she's been doing about her exercising. She's lifting weights and even doing some cardio. She does this very low calorie diet for a few weeks. And finally, she sees a one pound loss of body fat. Now, do you see what happened here? Lifting Laura had to take her calories to an extremely low level an extent literally that she could not maintain for a long period of time because it's too severe. She had to do this for multiple weeks until she got just a one pound change in her body fat levels. Now this doesn't change what we know about energy balance, but for some reason, her body just wasn't responsive to the fat loss stimulus that it used to be throughout her entire life. 